What's up, YouTube? I'm back with another video. And before we get started, if you get to the like button, subscribe, and share, I drop videos every day. Y'all know the gist. I'm trying to hit 1,000 by the end of the year. And before we get to business, you know the title. So I was on Twitter and I saw this tweet Spider Man 2 Drops. Awesome gameplay, serviceable story. Missing many features and suits from previous games. We're working on it. Doesn't elaborate. Four months later, still nothing. Spider-Man 2018 had three DLCs and new game plus out by now. Only bad suits incoming. And so it brings up a big question of what is going on with Marvel Spider-Man 2? Because we've been sitting here, we've been waiting. Like the tweet said, uh, this time in 2018 or 2019 when the DLC and stuff came out, we already had all the DLC and new game plus. So what is going on, right? And so it's, it's racking my brain like, Insomniac is really falling off. We it, we gotta talk about it. We gotta talk about it. They is it, it might reach the fatigue at the point where they throw in too many projects at Insomniac because you know the leaks with the whole uh, Wolverine, X Men, all the other stuff they have going on, the other Spider Man, how they want to split it all up and all that stuff. It's kind of feeling like they are they're getting overwhelmed. And before anyone says anything, oh my God, the the hack the hack is what pushed it down. No 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 no. The new game plus was already delayed before the hacks even started. Okay, before the hack even came out, all the stuff got leaked out. This stuff been delayed, and so we need to know what is really going on with this game. Like, what are they doing? Like, I'm not saying, oh my god, they should. And you, and you know, and you know, um, the the boy Evan was in here. <laughs> he he was in here fighting for his life. You know, um, what was it Game of Thrones when Jon Snow was about to fight against the army bombs? That's what he was on. He was like, yo, oh my god, insomnia. I got I gotta stop him. I gotta. <laughs> <laughs> it was fighting for his life. We ain't saying, yo, rush out any update center, but y'all need to be more communicated. And I mean, more and more talkative with the updates, what's going on. Because community over here, we're sitting here like sitting ducks, okay? People already replayed the game twice. I'm not replaying this game again. You are out of your mind if I'm going to sit here and replay, level all the way up and get that bum suit at the end of the game. No, we need, we need some more content here. We need, even if you just drop a new game plus, okay? New Game Plus by itself is decent enough, okay? The DLC, will worry about that in a later time, but New Game Plus is essential. Like, changing the uh, suit tendrils is, is essential. Like, these things should have already been prepared before. Like, because the thing about it that really bugs me is you can see they did quality control with something, but they don't do it with all of it. I know that it came out and said that Sony was basically like, yo, y'all not gonna reach the same quality as y'all did before because we need to rush this game out. And because Sony is like losing money, <laughs> if we're being honest, because there's nothing on the PS5. I don't, I don't care what anyone says. It's, I have had the Spider-Man edition of PS5. There is no game that I want to buy and actively play. And the game I did want to buy and play got canceled. So it's like, well, who cares now? Who? What am I doing this for? I bought this for nothing. Okay, I could have waited until this got on PC at this point. But back to what I was saying, there's so many things that are missing, like a social media tab, like the thing where you can. If your podcast get interrupted, you can't replay them to know what they were talking about, right? Even though the Danica podcast was annoying, but it's like all this stuff is unlike you should be. It should be fixable by now, right? And so what I was saying earlier about the quality control, the the problem that I have is when you use the uh, Iron Spider abilities with the legs, it changes colors depending on the suit that you have. But they don't do that for the Venom symbiote, like the whole crux of the game. I'm. It will make more sense if they did it for the Venom stuff and they didn't do it with the Iron Spider legs. Because it makes more sense. It's like, this is type of horror. This is the whole genesis of the game is about Venom. So let's make sure all the things involving the symbiotes and all that stuff gets fixed correct and we'll fix the other stuff later. But no, it's like, what are we, what are we doing here? And I understand, give them time and be patient. But at a certain point, we really need to start looking at what they're really doing. Because like this disappearing and like i get it once again i get it the hack thing was a mess but this was a problem before the hack started the state that it was launched in was not good and i'm not actually well i should ask for a perfect game because i'm spending 70 dollars for this game but i digress uh, what i'm saying is when you release something i want it to be the quality of it that it should be like why do we have to wait and get updates for stuff that already should be a thing and I'm not trying to hear it the, oh, give them patience, give them time. I give them my money. Like, I'm, <laughs> I 
can't walk up to a developer like, yo, if y'all could just give me, give me four more months to get the money, I, I, I'll play your game, but just, just, just give me, just give me more, give me one more chance, you know what I mean? Like, no, they want my money up front. I want the game an update up front. Excuse me. I'm sorry for paying for a product and wanted to be complete and have all the issues with it. Okay. And then don't come out talking about, oh my God, like. Uh, we cut like 80% of the dialogue that y'all are never going to see again. What is the point of that? They was they was talking crazy. They was talking crazy during the whole, oh man, like Marvel Spider-Man 2 is going to be the best Spider-Man game of all time. And then when it dropped and people had criticisms, they like, what, 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 what do you mean? It's just, we're hacked, we're hacked, we're hacked. Like, nah, bro, nah. No, don't hide your hand now. Don't, don't stand behind the rocks now. Like, hold on. Come back here. What are we doing here? I'm tired of people defending this company. I'm not saying they are way better than the worst companies in the world, right? They're not a Need A. They're not a Ubisoft. They're not a, a Square Enix. But we need to talk about the flaws of this company, okay? With or without the leaks, this game is an issue. <laughs> like, and people are going to come into my comments because some of y'all don't watch the videos. I know y'all don't. Some of y'all be yapping in the comments. I know it. And saying, oh my God, like, you just, you just want a quick update for everything. Like, no, I'm not saying that. I want it to be fixed in the beginning, and so I won't have to wait for an update. That's what I'm waiting on. I'm not even asking for the DLC up front. The DLC can wait, okay? But when I can't get updates for stuff that is clearly an issue, like the day and night cycle, and it's like, bro, this should have been in here day one, and it's not. And it's clearly because Sony is rushing it, and this is an issue with Sony. If they're gonna rush out every big first party title to get it on PlayStation and ruin the product, you're wondering why y'all sales are going down. Y'all wondering why there's an issue with people buying the, the PlayStation that you do all these things. It's like, bro, what are we doing here? So I mentioned earlier how Evan was in the, in the quotes, you know what I mean, trying to defend the game. Let's see what he had to say. Gee, it's almost like their entire company's employees were viciously attacked and had their next decade of projects unceremoniously leaked out which they're still recuperating from. How impatient do you have to be to complain about not instantly receiving free content? These features should have been there at launch. Of course, no one's saying otherwise, but they're working on the update that will include all those features and more, and by the time it's out it'll resolve a majority of people's issues. It's just a matter of time until it drops. For people claiming the game was rushed, y'all really want them to rush this update. And so of course Evan misses the entire point of the whole post by saying we want them to rush the uh, update and we're upset because we're not instantly getting free content. All I'm asking for and all he's asking for, well, I don't know the person, but all they're asking for is we want the features that should have been in the game in the game in the first place, okay? Even if you don't give us new game plus, let's, let's compromise here. Even if we can't get new game pr plus right away, right? Even though it was in Miles Morales when it dropped, but uh, whatever. What we can get is features that was in the first base game, okay? Like changing time of day, like the whole tentacle thing fi being fixed or whatever. Social media tab, podcast tabs, I can skip these certain things or I can replay these certain things. Things that were in the past game, that's what we are asking for. And he doesn't see, like, yo, I swear, this man, I don't know how he sees, every time there's Spider-Man criticism on the timeline, this man is is hyped to, to, to combat it. Like, I have nothing against the man, but yo, is every time he see a Spider-Man um, criticism, he, it, it's like Josh Giddy looking at a 15 year old. Like, oh, whoa, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> That was crazy, but it's like he, he be salivating. It's like, bro, he's like, yo, I got another one. I got another one to defend. It's like, dude, like, what are we doing here? It's okay. Insomniac has flaws, okay? Your favorite Spider-Man game has flaws. It's okay. We can admit it. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right, man. This is good. It's good. But, yo, it's like every time someone brings up a valid point, this man hops in the quote tweets. It's like, man, like, yo. Can, can we can can we let it go? Can we let it go? The game is flawed. It's not a masterpiece. Let it go. It's okay. It's okay. But let me know what y'all think, man. Am I tripping? Am I bugging here? I'll be in comments down below. Hit the like button, subscribe, and share. Peace.